always be the weak ones. Eat my missile! Damn scrap! Defeat the power of the spark! Disappointment, shame, and fury over these years burn! Eat my missile! Let all my disappointments, shame, and fury over these years burn! Damn scrap! Give it up, dude. It's over. This powered armor won't save you or Torch City. Subtle! You know nothing. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> With the power of the spark, I can defeat you! <sighs> defeat Cicero. Defeat the Legion. <laughs> Dew was a nut who was willing to throw his life away for the spark. How could he have protected other Ferdizans? Don't feel too bad about it, Ray. It's not your fault. His henchmen don't know the truth. For the sake of all Ferdizans, the Rat Gang must hold together. Now is not the time to worry about that. What now? The Legion is on the move, and the spark blew up. The spark isn't one of a kind. The traitor Cicero is already searching for another one. Hold on. How did you turn up here in the Duke's secret room? You think a two-bit rat gangster could have found out about the Western Range Mine? You were the one who told him. What are you really up to? Keeping the lid on the spark has been the mission of the Cat Clan for a thousand years. I was planning to use Dew to get the spark, then bury it deep underground, but... Is the spark really that important? Without the spark, Dew would have been a mere sneaky rumor monger. As guardians of the spark, the Cat Clan has seen countless lunatics offer themselves up to it. The existence of the spark always brings disaster. Help me bury the secret, please. Why do you trust me? Why wouldn't I seek the spark too? Thick-headed numbskulls are hard to find nowadays. Hmm. 
Did you say there is another spark? There is another one in the underground lake. We need to get to it before Cicero does. I must go now. Hey, silly bunny. Catch up to us when you've made up your mind. You still owe me, you know. What are you waiting for, you dumb rabbit? Lady Q left. Are you going to let her face Cicero alone? I'm going after her. To reach the underground lake, you must first go to the underwater base and find the oxygen mask. Don't ask me how I know. I got stiffed once. Go after her, rabbit. Remember to use the radio to stay in touch. Wait, what are you planning to do? Hey, my ears aren't as sensitive as yours. <sighs> you gave me such a fright. So, does that mean we're a team now? If I stick close to you, you won't be able to get up to any of your tricks. <laughs> I don't have time to play hide and seek with you. Seriously, though, to get to the underground lake, you must first... Go to the underwater base and find the oxygen mask. You and Urso were already in on this. Oh, you found us out. In that case, I'll tell you what to do once you get to the underground lake. Remember, use the bear's radio. This team is purely temporary, and I don't want to be indebted to you. That really breaks my heart. I was hoping you'd finish the mission for me if I don't come back. You want to settle the debt now? See you at the underground lake, silly bunny. Sink maps. I'm at the underwater base. Where is that mask you mentioned? The oxygen mask. The latest underwater rebreather device. I've marked its exact location on the map. The iron dogs don't need to breathe, so why does the underwater base have something like this? Ho oh, ho! Because it's from the great Ferdizan inventor, Urso! With it, you have free access to the sewers, the underground lake, and even the outer sea. <laughs> No wonder the Iron Dogs took them all away. Good thing I was smart enough and included a tracking device! <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
What are you doing? Oh, you seemed like you were having so much fun, so I came to cheer you on. There's a tough hexapod. Hmm. <sighs> New. Back in our day, we never saw iron dogs that could enter water. Hmm. Even the underwater areas are guarded. The Legion has really grown in strength over the years. You'll take them down, however many there are.
You again. This time, you have reason to let me go. Tell me. If you hurt me this time, it means there was no point in you letting me go last time. Let it be pointless then. I get up at 7 every morning and iron my tie. I then go to the energy station to get a full 8 hour charge and pick up a 4 hour temporary battery. I start work at 8 o'clock. I must check, inspect, and monitor the mission roster for 1,000 soldiers every day. Enough talking. To Ferguson's, we are the enemy, the Iron Dogs. To the heads of the Legion, however, we are mere cogs in the wheel, churning out work. Patrolling and writing reports both consume a lot of power. We must stay at our posts, even if we are low on battery or have rusty components. You can shut up now. All right. Before I shut up, though, I will repeat this one more time. Civilized Ferdison, please allow me to leave in a fitting manner.
Thank you.